Yes, my dear friend, welcome back to the channel. It is a beautiful Monday morning here in Southeast Asia, Malaysia, to be precise. Wherever you are on the globe, you are highly welcome. A lot to talk about, about our club, Chelsea Football Club. And dear friend, we'll not waste much of your time, but wherever you are in Africa, I'm glad to be back. It is a brand new week. It is Monday, the most difficult day of the week. Yes, it is Monday and we are up and doing already here in Southeast Asia. Wherever you are in Europe, in America, in Canada, anywhere you are, dear friend, I'm glad to be back. Let's get started. We've got so much to talk about. Yes, quickly. I am Madsen set to undergo medical test as new Aston Villa player. I am Madsen is set to undergo a medical test. Yes, yes. Chelsea just gave permission to proceed with medical at Netherlands camp. Chelsea has given the permission for that medical to take place at medical at Netherlands camp. Now, 37.5 million fee agreed upon with Chelsea, but players' contract almost agreed. Waiting on final details. Here we go. I am Martin to Aston Villa, and it's here we go. Dear friend, there is not much on that again. Now, from I am Martin, situations with Nicola Williams remain the same. The situation from with Nicola Williams remains the same according to Ben Jacobs. His release clause understood to be over just 45 million pounds is viewed as good value by potential suitors. Is viewed as good value by potential suitors, including Chelsea. However, total cost, including high wages, makes a deal difficult. Yes, this there is much more to this, and I will come back to that maybe in my next video. Or let me see if I have enough time here to elaborate more on this. Now, Barcelona, Arsenal, Chelsea, and Liverpool have all looked at Williams. He's been excellent at Euro 2024 so far, but may still need a lower, may still need to lower his wage if a move is to happen to Chelsea. All right, okay. You will say, yes, it is true, but the fact remains that. If the player is willing, the weight shouldn't be an issue. But there is a bigger problem. Yeah, there is a bigger problem. I will get back to that. But before I continue, Belgium get their first point in Group E by winning 2-0 against Romania. All right? Okay. Now, dear friend, over the weekend, the exciting news that we received the most exciting news that we received to counter Michael Olise's disappointment was Estaval William. Estaval William deal was concluded over the weekend. We saw the family pictures with Chelsea. We saw every the deal was signed and sealed, right? Great. That for me personally, here is Estaval's William family picture. I showed it to you before, but you can still have a view of it quickly. For those of you that missed out over the weekend. A recap of that is what you are seeing here right now. His family picture. All right. And uh, quickly, before I continue to other things, I want you to understand something here, dear friend. You see, Chelsea Football Club, we are in a different level right now. Different direction. We are taking a different style right now. Don't think your Chelsea that you know some years back is the same Chelsea today. Don't ever think so. It is a totally different Chelsea builder right now as we speak. And that is why I want to bring you this. I want to bring you this. You see, first of all, look at the kind of players Chelsea are looking at for right now. One is Omari Kellyman to Chelsea. Here we go. Who is Omari Kellyman? He is from Aston Villa, a young chap that is not known. But it is the deal that is already sealed and done. Deal in place on the player side after club to club agreement with Aston Villa. Verbal agreement on 90 million fee. Contract until 2030 plus one year option. Contract until 2030 plus one year option. 2005 born talent to join Chelsea FC in separate deal from Ayamatsen's deal. Medical book for today, Monday. 
His medical is today Monday, dear friend. So it means Omari Kelly from Aston Villa to Chelsea. It is the, a reality. It is. Before we continue, the jersey I showed to you, Chelsea kit I showed to you over the weekend, 2024, 2025, new kit. That is what you can see there on your screen right there. I showed it before. Now I'm bringing it back to you again. This is how it looks like on the players, on our players. It's beautiful. For me, I think rating this 1 to 10, I will rate it maybe, maybe 8. It's a very perfect shirt looking at it from here. It looks great. It looks great. And I'll also show you our away kit. Yes. As you can see on the screen, this is Chelsea's third kit. Chelsea 2024, 2025, third kit. Yeah, this is our third one. You know, it's an option. I think this really, I am not seeing it very clearly, but this should also be great on our players, dear friend. Yes, this should also be great on our players. All right, now let's get back to business. Let's get back to business. Okay. Just in, Jonathan David will cost less than 30 million pounds. Chelsea discussing him. Jonathan Davis, I brought up to you in my yesterday's special edition. Jonathan Davis is a Canadian international striker. Yes, the player that scored almost about 84 goals or so in about 130 something games. Jonathan Davis. Jonathan David will cost less than 30 million pounds. And Chelsea are working on that deal. We wait to see. And guess what? He is a player with Lily. According to Niza Kinzela, Chelsea are discussing Jonathan Davis. Not only him, there's another player which I'll bring to your notice in a few minutes. But just wait, just wait a minute. Alright? Just wait a minute. And I'll bring you that. You see, Chelsea have no intention to do some. Something crazy for players this season. Chelsea has no intention to do anything crazy this season for players. It has to be right this summer. They believe, for example, Nico Williams' wage. They believe, for example, Nico Williams' wage could cause an internal problem. Let's take it from there. You know, I started with Nico Williams and I came to Jonathan David. Now, Nico Williams is a left winger with a right foot. And Chelsea are in the market for a left winger with a right foot. Right footed player, left winger. Yes. Right, left footed. Left winger with a right footed. Left winger with a right footed. Left winger with a right footed player. That is what Chelsea are in the market for. And as you can see the short video there, Nico Williams just fit in perfectly. But the problem with Chelsea right now is this. It has to be right this summer. They believe, for example, Nico Williams' wage could cause an internal problem. If Nico Williams will be signed and be given what he wants, his current wage it with Atletico Bilabao is around £200,000 already. Meaning if he's to come to Chelsea, he must earn more than that. Therefore, it could create a problem within the, the squad. Why must he be given that amount? Chelsea are looking at all this. And that is why I want to say that Nico Williams with Chelsea, I don't see it happening, dear friend. No matter the news surrounding it, unless, 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 Unless players like Kopama right now, the new contract they want to offer him, an increased salary they want to offer him that could, you know, can match up. Otherwise, I don't see Nico Williams going to Chelsea this summer. Dear friend, that is how it is right now. That is how it is right now. All right. Okay. There are news about some other signings, some other players that Chelsea are looking at in the market. And I will come back to those ones in my later you know, episode. But quickly, this guy, Chelsea was working on this long ago, from last season, Checky, Ryan Checky, right? Breaking, 
Chelsea are also in the race to sign Leon Star Ryan Cheki. They have not sent any bid, but are monitoring the situation between PSG and Marseille. Ryan Cheki is a player that from last season we are following up. From last season. As a matter of fact, Kopama was not even the news last season. It was Kudus Ryan Cheki. Kudus Ryan Cheki. Before we realized it, we didn't get any. This season, Ryan Cheki is back again. And apart from Ryan Cheki, there are other players that are still in the pipeline. In my next episode, watch out. Because this is your breakfast news. Let me just let you be. I shall be back with more exclusives. Dear friend, like the video, share the video, and let me hear from you in the comment section. I'm just giving you the breaking news and what that transpired last night until this moment. To not, today, Monday, our Martin's medical is taking place and Chelsea are here to finalize the deal for Kelly. Kelly Mann, Omari Kelly Mann from Aston Villa. These two are very, very crucial. I'll see you in the next one when you see me, dear friend. Shalom and peace.